amazing view here. This is incredible. You can see, you can see the corona. Uh, this is a beautiful view. Now we have two minutes of, two, of totality. You can hear everyone so excited. Uh, I can see camera flashes along the beach. I don't know what those flashes are going to do, but, um, but it's good to see people getting into the uh, excitement and the atmosphere. Wow. At the moment, even with the uh, naked eye, we have stunning views here. Um, uh, yeah, uh, Fitzroy at the moment has a diamond ring. Uh, check that out. This view at the moment is amazing. The weather, uh, the clouds have moved just at the right time. This is beautiful. Wow, the prominence. This is incredible. We're seeing, uh, yeah, we are actually seeing some birds fly around. It's a bit bizarre. Uh, the temperature certainly has dropped. Uh, people all over the beach, excited, cheering. So uh, we've gone back to this beach camera while I've got a little bit of cloud cover. You can see that we've lost light. Uh, it's gone back to uh, like a, a sunrise type setting. It's amazing. Uh, if you look at the Fitzroy feed, even right now, Fitzroy looks amazing. Uh, you can see the sun's corona uh, on the Fitzroy feed. This is beautiful. Um, so, as I said, we have about two minutes worth of totality. Oh, we're starting to see a little bit of light rise again here. We'll be looking for that second diamond ring soon. That little bit of cloud cover here at uh, Port Douglas and the sun coming back out now. Fitzroy is amazing. Uh, please, oh, and look, we've now got that second diamond ring. Beautiful. If you need to see, if you need to see the second view, uh, please, facebook.com, Panasonic Eclipse Live by Solar Power. A little bit of cloud cover there, but you can still see uh, we're going back into partial now. So um, right here on the beach, uh, everyone is incredibly excited. This is an amazing event. We've, uh, we've got some uh, good views at the moment. And we'll bring these to you now. So we're uh, currently on the high magnification camera. Uh, this high camera, you can see at the moment uh, the sun just heading back into partial eclipse. We've, uh, we've had totality, we're heading out of it. Uh, everything we thought would happen has happened. The temperature's dropped. Uh, a weird kind of eerie noise at that time. To the naked eye, the sky looked like it was going back to uh, sunrise. Amazing view at the moment.
So uh, walking out along the beach, there's a huge number of people who have actually come out. So uh, in just a moment, I'm going to go have a talk with uh, Dave and Sue. Uh, Dave's experienced two solar eclipses previously. Dave, I don't really know what to say, to be quite honest. What did you guys think? I, I, I might start with your wife, because it's your first time. Okay. Well, I cried. It was amazing. Absolutely stunning. Uh, and it was, David had told me all about it, what to expect, but you still are so moved. It's incredible, is it? I, I did feel that temperature drop. It certainly dropped. Um, and obviously we had that sort of sunrise kind of look about the sky. We were incredibly lucky because that break happened just just at the right time. And, you know, I had been incredibly fortunate with my other ones because it was much clearer. But, but to have that moment and to be able to experience that again. It, it's pretty hard for us to express to, to anyone watching what it's like to act experience it in person um, the, the images that we had on the screen looked stunning and just at the right at right time as well which was amazing but um, to actually experience and see everywhere just go dark and that silence and everything uh, was amazing so tell me we we come back for 2029 oh it, I'll do um, I'm looking for ones in between there as well yeah, you won't wait that long a couple of years so uh, who knows, maybe we'll be able to bring that one and I'll be able to go to the States and, uh, and do that as well. I have to say that, that our month here in Australia has been absolutely phenomenal and to top it off like this is just spectacular. What an event to see. Yeah. We have to say that today is our anniversary. Oh, happy anniversary to both of you. What a <laughs> You timed that pretty well. Good job. So I'm guessing you planned your, uh, your wedding date years ago. You looked ahead at the eclipse calendar and thought, that day. <laughs> This one plans they had for everything. Yeah, I like that thinking. All right, well, congratulations. Enjoy the rest of your day, and um, uh, maybe you'll even see a little bit more of that partial as it comes out. We'll see. All right, thanks for your time. <laughs> Thank you very much. All right, guys, so uh, there you have. We're out of totality now, the end of the partial eclipse. Um, so our whole broadcast that you saw here and you've seen, we've been bringing to you using only power generated from the sun. Uh, so all of our equipment, uh, the telescopes, the cameras, all of the equipment has been powered uh, using solar power. We've used that solar panel, so those Panasonic hit solar panels, to store that energy in our portable lithium ion batteries. And those batteries, we have around 30 of them, and we're using those to actually uh, power the whole broadcast.